It's an ordinary day in an ordinary Finnish town in an ordinary home. Elena, nine years old, lives here. She has a father, a mother, and a little brother. Elena likes to play on the swing, but today she doesn't swing. Her father has come home. She sees that her mother is scared. Elena is scared too. She knows that she has to be good now. Elena feels the same as she always does before a thunderstorm. And when the lightning starts to strike, she would like to disappear like water out of a tub. After it's all over, Elena and her little brother find their mother in the bedroom. Their mother presses the frightened children close to her, trying to calm them. The next morning, after Elena's father has left for work, her mother talks on the phone and tells Elena and her little brother to pack their bedtime toys and pajamas in their backpacks. Outside, their mother calls a taxi and asks the driver to take them to the shelter. That sounds safe, thinks Elena. When they get there, they're greeted by a kind worker who offers them sandwiches and hot cocoa. Elena, her mother, and little brother can talk with the workers about anything, or they can just play. Elena thinks that's nice. Elena's story is the story of many Finnish families. In Elena's family, her father acts violently, but in domestic settings, the abuser can also be some other close person, regardless of gender. The shelter offers a way out of the eye of the storm. 24-hour surveillance guarantees that the shelter is a safe place, as its name suggests. It's a place like home, where you're protected from violence and where you can receive help to end the violence. The shelter is free and it's open around the clock. In addition to the crisis support provided by trained workers, the shelter is also a place where you can meet other people in a similar situation and get support in organizing a new life. The abuser can also get help through the shelter. While there's a way to escape violence, different issues and emotions can make leaving a violent relationship difficult. For Elena, her little brother and mother, the shelter was a door to a brighter and safer everyday life. Do not hesitate. Call us or just come.